Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. In the uh, great standing of my tradition of doing weird things, this is Alon Paul, and we're gonna about to take our pilgrim for a little trip here. So, as you can see, we're kind of on a low atmo planet here, and if you saw my last video in regards to jumping my pilgrim, which is this motorcycle unit here, Vexocraft, from space, that is from my freighter, down to uh, off the freighter and onto the onto the ground. Well, I decided to try to go the other way with this. That's right. Welcome to Stairway to Heaven. Now, this was a very interesting build. I'm actually recording the audio well after the um, video was made, and uh, yeah, this is uh, was quite the feat of building of getting this to work. This was over six hundred stairs 600 stairs and if you can think about that for just a minute each piece of stair here is one floor this is equivalent to a 600 story building reaching into space and we're taking our pilgrim for a little trip up there no we're not quite going to make it to our freighter um it's not that i gave up i literally ran out of supplies i should have done this in creative mode didn't even think about it not important the point was i just wanted to get the pilgrim into space and here we are we're able to do it so here we're climbing all the way up this is my first uh, platform one and only platform up in the sky here and you can see how high we are already it's pretty crazy high um and we just need to turn the bike a little bit and you got to be very careful here i jumped out for just a moment to just get a picture of the whole thing so we're going to transition for a second here and we're back, and as you can see, we're progressing onwards now up the uh, top of the uh, up more of this of the slide to go up here, um, these stairs. And as we head on up, uh, we're going to be uh, getting to a point where it's going to get kind of strange. Now, I don't know how to describe this to you. It's apparently this obviously shouldn't be done. You obviously shouldn't be able to build stairs this high up into the sky. And as, a, as just so you all know, if you build something this high from your base <clears throat> using all the glitchy methods that you could possibly do to get the stairs to go all the way up here with just one base computer, um, if you reload and go back up there, you will find that your stairs have disappeared. Most of them have gone. So this is a one-time only trip. These stairs do not exist anymore. They have vanished. So as we continue up the stairs here, I, you know, kind of glitching a little bit. I know that's like, like I'm slowing down and then speeding up, slowing down, speeding up, because you're, we're going to get to a point where it's going to get kind of strange. So we are literally heading up at full speed. Now, the reason I use this particular bike... Oh, yeah, see, we have just entered space now. We are literally in space as we speak. Uh, we're going at the same speed, and the Pilgrim is the fastest of the Exocraft, in case you all didn't know that. Uh, that's why we use it. And plus it fits on the stairs better, of course. But we are now in space, and you can see how everything's kind of glitchy, and we're having trouble controlling our bike. <clears throat> Trying to keep it straight on the actual path here. My first attempt to go all the way up to the top um, failed. And in a couple of moments, we're going to see something else happen. Watch. Yep, that's right. The bike disappears. But fortunately, we're at the very top here. So here we go. We're out into space. Now, for some reason, because you're in your exocraft, it doesn't recognize the fact that you're in space and your life support doesn't drop. And in a couple extra moments as we enter the atmosphere, we should... There it goes. Our bike returns. <laughs> as you can see, the speed has increased. It's nearly doubled in speed because of our dropping, but it does slow down. It actually levels out as far as the speed is concerned. We're at 45 right now, and it's going to just start dropping in a little bit. Yeah, we hit 46. That's about the fastest we're going to be going. You see, it doesn't quite go any faster after this. So we've reached a sort of terminal velocity, if you will. And I found this to be so humorous, and I had a great time. I had an absolute blast doing this. It was so much fun. Here's the bounce. Boing. <laughs> Yep, and you can get some great height on low Atmo planets with your Pilgrim. So, have fun doing that. That by itself is a lot of fun to do. Ooh, almost dropped into a pit. 
there we go and you can see we, we can't even get a good register on how far away from our base are except that by driving there it would literally take upwards of about yeah see almost seven minutes to get there just by driving there so we're going to go there just for a few moments but uh yeah that's pretty much the end of this video so i want to thank you all for watching this just hit the like button i know it's only like about you know five six minutes long and uh not even that much right yeah about six minutes long but yeah i hope you liked what you saw here and uh yeah, had a great, great time doing this, um, to say the least. So, just want to thank you all. And uh, see, we're just going to go ahead and just jump out and grab our ship real quick. Um, there's no reason to even bother at this point. Um, so, we're bringing in our ship, and we're just going to fly back to our base. It's the faster way to get there. And as we approach and land, get out, want to thank you all for watching again. There's our stairway to heaven. Ladies and gentlemen, yet another milestone achieved of stupidity and craziness. Uh, again, thank you all for watching, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. All right, guys, take care. We'll see you then. See you later. Bye-bye.